Gregory of Tours on the conversion of Clovis. It came about that two armies were fighting fiercely. There was much slaughter, and Clovis' army began to be in danger of destruction. He saw it and raised his eyes to heaven, and with remorse in his heart he burst into tears and cried, Jesus Christ, whom Clotilda asserts to be the Son of the living God, who art said to give aid to those in distress and bestow on those victory who have hope in thee, I beseech the glory of thy aid. And with the vow that if thou wilt grant me victory over these enemies, I shall know that thy power, which she says that people dedicate in thy name, had from thee. I will believe in thee and be baptized in thy name, for I have invoked my own gods, but, as I see, they have withdrawn from aiding me, and therefore I believe that they possess no power, since they do not help those who obey them. I now call upon thee. I desire to believe thee. Only let me be rescued from my adversaries. And when he said this, the Alamani turned their backs and began to disperse in flight. And when they saw that their king was killed, they submitted to the dominion of Clovis, saying, Let not the people perish further. We pray, we are yours now. And he stopped the fighting and encouraged his men to retire in peace. And he told the queen how he had the merit to win the victory by calling on the name of Christ.